Hello and welcome back to Dental Digest. In today's episode, we're talking about eight brushing mistakes that you guys are making that are actually harming your teeth. So let's talk about that. If you guys have any issues trying to figure out what's the best products for yourself or you want to learn more about dental products, make sure to hang around this channel because I got lots of sweet content coming up soon. Welcome back to Dental Digest and in today's episode, I'm here to help you guys with your brushing techniques. Coming up first on the list is you guys just keeping your toothbrush for way too long. A normal toothbrush should last anywhere from three to four months. So once you start to recognize that the bristles are starting to fray and get dull, it's time to swap it out. And when it comes time to deciding which toothbrush is best for you, head over to my TikTok to watch some of my videos to see which toothbrush you think would be best for you. The second mistake you guys are making is you guys are just brushing way too hard. An easy way to tell if you're brushing too hard is if your bristles just go flat after a short period of time. Now you may think that if you brush really hard, you're going to clean your teeth better, and that's not true. It only takes a gentle amount of force to actually clean your teeth, so just make sure you're brushing your teeth very gently because that's all you need. Brushing your teeth really hard can cause damage to your gums and smile, so please avoid brushing too hard. All it takes is a gentle amount of force to actually clean your teeth correctly. The next common mistake is you guys aren't brushing for long enough. The normal person's falling short with only brushing for 45 seconds. You guys are going to want to brush for two minutes for twice a day, one in the morning and one right before you go to bed. The fourth mistake is you guys are brushing immediately after eating. This is not good and let me quickly explain why. If you guys are brushing immediately after eating, it's not giving time for your saliva to build up a protective layer over your teeth. So it's important to wait 20 to 60 minutes before brushing. This will give plenty of time for your saliva to build that protective layer over your teeth. However though, if you really need to clean your teeth immediately after eating, it's better to rinse your mouth out with water or mouthwash. The fifth mistake you guys are making is you guys are storing your brush incorrectly. You guys wanna make sure you guys aren't completely sealing your toothbrush. The reason being this is gonna promote bacteria growth on your toothbrush, which is really gross, so avoid that. But at the same time, you guys don't wanna leave your toothbrush out in the open in your bathroom because according to some studies, because there's a high probability that human will actually be on your toothbrush. So a safe route to go is actually storing it in a medicine cabinet or a drawer. One pro tip that I do is I actually buy these bristle head covers which protect the front and leave the back open, allowing it to breathe, but at the same time protecting it from any of the dust that's in the air. Now let's talk about the sixth mistake you guys are making and quite possibly the most important to me and that is not using the best toothbrushes and toothpaste designed for you. A lot of people have different needs, whether you have braces, sensitive gums, ergonomic handle to hold, or you want something that looks sleek in your bathroom, or if you want whiter teeth, if you have a lot of calculus buildup. There's so many products out there, it can be pretty overwhelming in deciding which is best for you, especially since everyone has different needs. And in order to help you guys out, I've created a comprehensive video series talking about all these dental products and helping you guys discover the best products for your individual cases. So make sure to hit the like button on this video and subscribe to this channel to make sure you guys know when that video series is released because I want to make sure you guys have the best smile possible and that all boils down to the correct products that you guys are using. Let's wrap up this episode real quick by talking about the last two mistakes you guys are making. The first one being you guys are rinsing your mouth out after you brush your teeth. This is actually a pretty cool pro tip if you just spit out all the excess toothpaste and leave some residing on your teeth. This is going to allow the fluoride in the toothpaste to sit on your teeth for a longer period of time, better protecting you guys from cavities. There's a lot of beneficial agents inside toothpaste to help you whiten your teeth, prevent sensitivity, and also help prevent from cavities. So when you rinse your mouth out, you guys are washing away all those beneficial agents. So what you guys are going to want to do is just spit out the excess toothpaste and allow some of it to sit on your teeth for a long period of time. This is definitely going to help you guys have a whiter smile, less sensitive teeth, and prevent you guys from having cavities. Now let's talk about the last mistake and that's actually extremely important is you guys are forgetting to brush your tongue. Why is it so critical to brush your tongue? Well actually your tongue has lots of bacteria on it and forgetting to brush your tongue will commonly lead to bad breath. All it takes is some gentle brushing or scrubbing of your tongue. So make sure you guys add that to your oral health care routine to make sure you have some nice breath and some nice healthy teeth. Thank you for watching today's episode. I hope you guys were able to improve your brushing technique. We'll see you guys in the next one and as always, smile on. Ciao. Yeah.